Hey guys, I just uh, wanted to show you something that I promised you before. I um, downloaded this app called Pi, and this is my buddy's uh, iPhone 4 versus my iPhone 4S. I gotta find Pi in here real quick. Should probably done that before. Here we go. Okay, so that it's installed on both. Again, uh, iPhone 4 versus 4S. Pi is running in the background on each one. Um, right now so I'm gonna start it I'm gonna set them both to run at 32,000 digits of pi and hit calculate so what this is gonna do is it's gonna kinda measure the processor speed between the two again this is the 4 this is the 4s um, and this one's already done so up to 32,000 digits of pi in 4.64 seconds but this guy is still going. Now remember, these are both on iOS 5. Uh, there's nothing running in the background. Neither one is plugged in. And they're both in airplane mode. 15.84. Um, okay, now I've ran this several times. I've got very consistent results. So 4.64 seconds, 15.84. Pretty big difference, if you ask me. Um, Really, it's almost four times faster when it comes to calculating the digits of pi, which is, I believe, a floating point calculation. So this processor is pretty amazing. Um, doesn't really translate the game the same way in, in necessarily all apps, but in some apps you're going to see some incredible speeds, uh, especially in gaming because uh, you know gaming does that sort of calculation uh, more than any other app. You know your normal apps that just manipulate text and save records to a database and come back. You're not going to save a whole lot of um, time with those, but uh, with with something like this um, or anything that does a lot of calculations per second, uh, this 4S is definitely going to win. Anyway, leave comments and uh, click on any um, of the sponsored links if you uh, if you could to support these videos. Thank you.